Enter the 70s, a time of economic struggles and technological innovation. ABBA win the Eurovision Song Contest with Waterloo. Peru was always ahead of the game. The slide rule was replaced with a calculator and computer systems were introduced to increase efficiency. In 1974, the company won the huge Ara Cruz project in Brazil. Many of its Finnish families relocated and learned Brazilian Portuguese. A UK office was set up in Kent to market services to the English-speaking world. Recognising the success, Yaku Peru was awarded the Entrepreneur's Prize in Finland. In 1976, employees topped 1,000. Being successful meant being there with clients to know and predict their needs. 25 years later, the company had gone from two to 1,200 committed employees, speaking 20 languages, located in five continents and with projects spanning the planet. By 1979, Yakuperu had grown a global pulp and paper industry and had become one of the largest independent forest consulting and engineering organisations in the world. That year, as a major paper consumer itself, the company used 24 tonnes of paper. Did you know that's 523 metres high, almost as tall as the CN Tower in Toronto?